or polyether ether ketone. So it's part of a family of polymers and it's widely regarded as one of the highest performing polymers in the world. Generally characterized as a combination of mechanical strength, chemical resistance, all in high temperature environments. I think the extreme is 10,000 feet under the sea to 40,000 feet above it and actually everything in between. If I start with the first of those, the 10,000 feet under the sea, in the oil and gas industry peak is used in electrical connectors to double their lifetime, increase uptime and then reduce costs. Going to 40,000 feet above the sea, in the aero business with our peak based thermoplastic composites, we're helping customers solve their their efficiency and lightweight problems, as well as increasing their productivity to reduce the plane build lines. So the reason for moving from metal to polymers, and particularly peak, is there's two reasons. One, for the performance benefits that they get. So examples there is around lightweighting, uh, also improvements in NVH or noise reduction. The other areas that you can see benefits are around manufacturing. So complete simplification of the manufacturing process removing costs, removing lead times, removing complexity is the other reason that peak is being selected over metals now. It's even though people might not realise it, they are users of uh, Victrex Peak. You know, when you get in an aircraft, when you want to travel in your car, when you're talking on your mobile phone or, or playing your, uh, your music loud, uh, the quality of that sound is, is thanks to, uh, to, you know, to Victrex Film. Um, from a medical perspective, you know, we're, we're improving uh, patient outcomes uh, with the, with the uh, implantable materials. Uh, so really is a, a very important part of, of, uh, of, of everybody's life.